So, if you have any examples questions, let's move on to exercise questions. Examples are very, very important. Please do watch the previous videos also. Example question you solve. Okay, so that will give you more idea. Show that the function r star to r star defined by f of x, which is equal to 1 by x is 1, 1 and on to where r star is a set of all non-zero real numbers. Non-zero is not the same. r plus basically. So, in the negative numbers, it is going to be all greater than zero. So, the values are all greater than 0, okay? And it is going to be a real number. Is the result true? So, first 1, 1 on to, check panla. So, we have f of x equals 1 by x. So, how do you prove 1, 1 function? We solved a lot of examples, but I'll again explain. So, when you have to prove a 1, 1 function, if you have x, f of x1 equals x2, then you need to prove that x1 equals x2. So, this is we prove. So, if f of x1 and i, it is going to be 1 divided by x1. I am just substituting the value of x1 here. So, this is equal to 1 divided by x2. If I cross multiply, I have x2 equals x1. So, I got what is needed. So, since when f of x1 equals f of x2, x1 is also equal to x2, which means this function is 1, 1. Okay? Now, we will prove it. Now, on 2, we will do it. On 2, you have to remember this definition. This is the mark. Okay? So, you have to write function from capital X to capital Y. Correct? In that way, in that way. X to Y. For every Y belongs to Y. So, in that way, all elements are mapped. On to the other way, all the elements that are on the output side have to be mapped. One element is missed. Okay? In the previous video, I will tell you an example. Let's see. For every element in Y, there exist X in X. So, in that way, there is no element missed. But, in that way, all element Y is missed. If you have element x, how do you have f of x equals y? So, if you have x substitute for x, it will be y. Okay? So, that's what you have. So, how do you prove it here? You have f of x equals 1 by x. So, you have f of x equals 1 by x. So, you have y equals 1 by x. So, x value and x is going to be 1 by y. So, if y is the value, if I put it to be 2, I have x equals 1 by 2 and this belongs to real numbers. Correct? Positive value of real number. In this case, I have to give r plus. So, it definitely belongs to the positive value of real number. Okay? So, this is going to be on 2. Since this is 1, 1 and on 2, we say that this is going to be bijective. If a second, I have to give the second part of the question. Is the result true if the domain is re... Domain r star is replaced by natural numbers. Now, I have to give the domain and it is going to be this side. With the co-domain being r plus. So, in that way, in the r plus, this becomes natural number. So, is the result same? If it is all natural numbers, if all natural numbers, it is definitely going to be 1, 1. But on to function, we say that x belongs to natural numbers and y belongs to r plus. So, for example, if I put the value y equals 2, x becomes half. But x equals half does not belong to natural number. Natural number again the start agree, it only starts from 1, 2, 3, 4 and so on. So, if you change the condition in such a way, then it is not on 2. Okay? So, it is not on 2. Okay? Please copy. So, this is the first question. So, in the domain range the main. That is important. Okay? Question number 2. Check the injectivity and surjectivity. Injectivity na enna? When you talk about one one function, that is injectivity in solra. Injection na enna arthon. You have a needle. That is ebdi kuttu mode. Enna agde oray oray arthala matunda na varda. Multiple arthala varda. Varla. So oray oray arthala matunda inject panro. So that is going to be one one. So injectivity na we are talking about one to one function and surjectivity abdi na we are talking about on to function. Okay. In the pair alla na avochno. Check the injectivity and surjectivity of the following function. So first. 1, 1, you have f of x equals x square. The domain is very, very important. It is from natural number to natural number. Okay, but 1, 1, every check on the You have f of x1 equals f of x2, which means x1, the whole square equals x2, the whole square. Natural number na plus or minus varad. In a natural numbers are all positive numbers, so no negative numbers. So you have x1 equals x2. So since f of x1 equals f of x2 and x1 is equal to x2, we say that. This is going to be a 1, 1 function. If on 2, can upon on 2, what is it? Function x to y. And could you For every y belongs to capital Y, there exists x belongs to capital X, for which f of x equals y. Okay, now part 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, first in a relation, upper y, upper x, upper x, y, in a relation. Okay, four different things you have to remember. This is mark. Okay, so how do you prove? You have f of x 
equals x square y equals x square so x equals square root of y so when i put value of y equals 2 i have x equals root 2 but this does not belong to natural number number of the domain in it is going to be natural number so which means this is not on 2 okay so first question is going to be injective but not surjective okay first question what is the second subsection so what is the second subsection it is going to be the exact same question do you see in f of x equals x square in f of x equals x square third question me f of x equals x square but what is the difference here and there is a natural number here you have integers and in the third subsection you have real numbers okay so adala pay attention and solve such questions so ipa second subsection poda pora where it is going to be integer ipa integer na en artham you have to repeat the same thing so when you talk about one one function you have f of x1 equals f of x2 which means x1 square equals x2 square when you take square root on both sides here we are talking about the integer so you have plus or minus x1 equals plus or minus x2 but in there is no you have x1 equals x2 this is correct but there is one more case where x1 equals minus x2 and minus x1 equals x2 in the case correct no it is not correct so this is not 1 1 now if on 2 we do on 2 it is going to be the same thing you have function from x to y for every y belongs to capital y there exists x belongs to capital x for which f of x equals y in the definition there you know so you have f of x equals x square so y equals x square x equals square root of y again x belongs to integer but in there root y equals 2 in pota you have root 2 correct if y equals 2 in pota i'll have root 2 and it does not belong to the integer so it is not on 2 okay so this is how you write if a third subsection in your so third subsection and you have f of x equals x square again you have the same thing whatever you repeated in the first subsection so you have f of x1 equals f of x2 but x1 not equal to x2 okay so it is not 1 1 okay similarly on to you have y equals x square so x equals square root of y y equals 2 in pota, I have x equals square root of 2, which does not belong to real numbers. Okay, it is an irrational number. Root 2 and an irrational number. So, this does not belong to the real number, which means it is not 1, 1 and not on 2. Okay. Ipa fourth subsection. So, f from natural numbers. So, this is also going to be very, very easy. Ipa number of function and let me write it. So, you have f of x1 f equals f of x2. What is our function going to be? f of x equals x cube. So, you have x1 cube equals x2 cube. When you take cube root on both sides, you have x1 equals x2. And since it belongs to natural number, natural number, all the values are going to be positive. So, this is true and hence it is 1, 1. If on 2, what is the definition? Write it along with me. For function from x to y, for every y, small y belongs to capital Y, there exists small x belongs to capital X for which f of x equals y. Okay, in the Maria Diacha, Ipena the f of x equals x cube, y equals x cube, so x equals cube root of y. Okay, so when y equals 3, you have x equals cube root of 3, which does not belong to natural numbers. So this is not on 2. Punjada on 2 function, I illian every proof under the y is equal to and the function I equate punte x under putchte x and the range la illa domain la irkan pakam. Okay. Please copy. Now, last subsection, you have integers. If integers in the go, it is going to be the exact same thing. So, when you have a 1, 1 function, you have f of x1 equals f of x2. You have x1 cube equals x2 cube. When you take the cube root on both sides, you have x1 equals x2. Since this belongs to integers, it is going to be true. So, this function is going to be 1, 1. Okay. If on 2, there is problem. So, on 2, can you do you have to write this for every question. F from x to y. For every y belongs to y, there exists x belongs to x for which f of x equals y. So, you have y equals x cube. Again, x equals cube root of y. When y equals 2, I have x equals cube root of 2 and this does not belong to integers. Hence, it is not on 2. In the Martha exam, okay? Moving on to question number 3. Prove that the greatest integer function f of x equals g i f of x. This is the greatest integer function. So, this symbol represents 
greatest integer function. Nama WhatsApp la anupura gif kadayadu. This is greatest integer function. Okay? Abdi na anartho. So whenever you have some value. Ipo oru number line irukku abdi na. Let me draw the graph for you. Or let me just explain. So you have oru number line. Okay? So in the ethila you have the values 2 and 3. Okay? So whenever you take the value in the ethila 2.1. 2.2, 2.3, 2.4, 2.9 varikume. When you take x equals 2.5, I have f of x equals the greatest integer function of 2.5 which is going to be 2. So for all the values which are less than 3, the value is going to be 2. For all the values which are greater than 3 but 4 kulla erikano, it is going to be all 3. Kunjada, ipo, when x equals 2.8, f of x equals 2 point, GIF of 2.8 which is also going to be 2. If x is equal to 3.1 in Pochanada, f of x is equal to 3.1 which is going to be 3. The value which is very very close in the earth, in 2, in the whole number are go, and the number are go. Okay, so that is the greatest integer function. So, how do you prove if 1, 1, Abdina, you have f of x1 equals f of x2. You have f of, for example, if this is x1 and this is x2, you have f of x1, f of x2, you have f of x1 equals f of x2, but you see that clearly x1 is not equal to x2. So, you have x1 not equal to x2. So, from this we say that it is not 1, 1. Punjada, so, greatest integer function is not 1, 1. Okay. Ipo on to. On to kena prove on a function from x to y. For every y belongs to capital Y, there exists x from capital X where f of x equals y. Correct, I put domain range la yalla me cover agano. So, what is your range here? It is going to be all real numbers. But, number one question is f of x equals gif of x. If you take f of x to be 4.1, you have gif of 4.1 is going to be 4. When you take f of 4.8, it is going to be 4.8 or the GIF which is going to be 4. When you have f of 5.7, it is going to be GIF of 5.7 which is going to be 5. So, this is what I When even if you substitute a real number or a decimal number, anything you substitute, your output is always a natural number. Do you see? It is going to be a natural number. It, natural number it is going to be all integers. Correct? It is negative. So, negative is f of you have minus 4.5 you will get the smaller value. So, here you have minus 4.5 which means you have to look at the left of the number line. If number line is here, you have 4.5 minus 4.5 here, minus 4 here and minus 5 here. Always you take the value which is to the left. Okay, in the positive values, you always took the values which is to the left. It is lesser value. Okay, so here you see it is going to be all integers, positive and negative numbers, but it all it is all going to be integers. So y belongs to integer, but y does not cover all the real numbers. Correct? Y is only the integers and it does not map the whole range. Correct? Which is going to be real numbers. So, this is not on 2. Kunjada 4.1, 4.2 apdi irukhi, map agami irukhi. So, if you have, for example, in the pako, in the pako irukhi abdi na, here you are only mapping to 1, 2, 3. You are leaving nadu lehen irukhi, 1.1, 1.2, 2.1 .1, adala irukhi. Adala map pannave illa. So, the output side le, there are a lot of values which are not mapped, which means it is not on 2. Okay, kunjada. Now, question number 4. Show that the modulus function is neither 1, 1 nor on 2. So, mod value is always going to be a positive value. But mod of minus 1 is also going to be 1. Mod of 1 is also going to be 1. So, either number 1, 1 on 2, every proof under there. When you talk about 1, 1 cases, you have f of x1 equals f of x2. If for example, when x is equal to minus 1, you have mod x, which is mod of minus 1 is going to be 1. When x is equal to 1, you have mod of x, which is mod of 1, which is also going to be 1. So, here I see that f of x1 equals f of x2, but x1 is not equal to x2. Let me take this as x1, x2. So, I have x1, x2. So, you see that x1 is not equal to x2. So, it does not satisfy the 1, 1 condition. So, this is not 1, 1. Okay. Ipo on to ke na paka poro. On to ke from fu for function from x to y. For every y belongs to capital Y. There exists x belongs to capital X. 
for which f of x equals y. Correct? Now, on to function. Even if you have map, you have minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, 0, 1, 2, 3 and so on. You have all the numbers here. But on the right hand side, it is mapped from r to r. So, in the pakamo enarke, you have minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, 0, 1, 2, 3 and so on. You have. You will always end up getting a positive value. So, in that way, you will only map all the positive values but all these negative values are not mapped which means this is not on to okay because all the values all the values in the output are not mapped okay please copy